video of Palm Bay, Florida. We just moved here recently and I just wanted to give everybody a little tour of the town. Now this is, um, is this San Filippo or St. Andre? This is De Groot and this is where a lot of the houses are. Um, here, over here we have Stillwater Lakes. This is where a lot of the fancy homes are. I do believe there is a golf course back there. But you'll see a lot of the nicer homes over there. Um, those are probably going to run you close to a million dollars. It just depends. Some of them are in the 700s, the 800s. And then over here we have more of the affordable housing, which is going to run you in like the three to 400 range. And everything's really nicely manicured. Um, they have sidewalks here, so if you're big into running, you like to take your baby for a little walk. Um, lots of sidewalks. And it's just so beautiful here with all the palms. The uh, different wildlife here. We've seen um, bunnies. We've seen... Um, oh, and here's the... There, that was the elementary school back, or actually this is the elementary school right here. This is the west side. And then um, over here on the right coming up, we're going to have the high school, which is called Bayside. And it's actually pretty big. Uh, we came from a quad A high school in um, Snellville, Georgia. So I, th I don't think that's quad a high school but um it's a pretty nice um high school nonetheless um it's called bayside so anyway it's really nice really well maintained there's a place bar sitting outside every day so that is the high school they have um, what looks to be a new theater department on the other side. We're about to pass it. And, um, all the schools are rated really well here. So, um, there's sevens. If you wanted to know, you can look it up on, uh, greatschools.org as well. It's a two-story school. It looks a little bit newer. I haven't looked up the year of the school, but here's the performing arts place kid is big into drama and then they have a little sports field and then there's a canal behind it but it's fenced off so and then there's a canal down here and I just love this little street right here with all the oaks on the side and there's some nicer neighborhoods down here too we live kind of in the sticks um, but we like it back there it's nice and quiet there's not as many homes it's back by a preserve, so they can never build back there. And um, that's our home. And this is another nice neighborhood up over here on the right. It's a gated community. Um, they're a little bit older, but what I like about them is a lot of them have ingrown pools. And if you've been looking at homes in Florida, you will know that um, there is a one-year wait for a pool. So we're going to have to wait for that pool. We have a nice little 15 foot round and ground pool right now, which serves us fine. It's just a little hot because we don't have a cage yet, but we're planning on doing that very soon. Um, and there's just uh, like a church up here on the left. It's called Grace Bible Church. There's martial arts. There's a dentistry place. There's um, a veterinarian place. Um, there's lots of little shopping centers, nail places, 7-Eleven, you got your Dollar General, you got your Publix, you got your Dunkin' Donuts, and this is, um, Kogan Road, and this is Bayside Lakes Intersection, and there's a Walgreens up here, so, yeah, and then there's a McDonald's, there's all different types of places to eat. There's a mobile gas station. Right now our gas is 4.47. Um, and then there's the Beef O'Brady's. There's a 
Kobe Steakhouse, there's a Subway, and we used to go to Subway all the time in Georgia, but we now we go to Wawa because they give you like 20 times more meat, and it's like half the price, and it's so much better. So, anyway. Um... But anyway, this is my tour of Palm Bay. Let me know if you want me to make more videos, okay? Um, thanks for watching. This is Megan. Bye.